Hey folks, Tom Battinger here, or FDOT as you might know me. A lot of stuff is going on a little bit crazy when it comes to how the rosters are going to land after last season. I've heard the term roster apocalypse tossed around. Either way, players going in 27,000 different directions, and I'm going to break it down for you right here. So as this is the very beginning of the offseason, there's just a couple of information points that I want to deliver to you as we get things going. We'll have more information and, of course, more videos to split that out. Right now, starting over in North America, it's Flashpoint that has really blown up. Vedium, Homiefe, and Benji are now free agents without a team. They have left the unit and they are looking for a team by themselves. Switching over to Europe, we have a couple of players that have formed their own team, and it goes by, well, Variety's new team. If you couldn't tell from the moniker, it's Variety's new team. It features Variety on a new team. Surrounding him will be the jungler Kivo Fred, Zeros in the mid lane, Trix Tank and Arkel, one of the hunters from last season that performed very well, although not on a strong team. With this new squad, Europe should have another main contender for the top of the rock. Latin America has also seen some changes. Kokosi and Nozix are going to leave their individual teams. Nozix will be on Isaurus now, whereas Kokosi is just a free agent. He'll be searching for a new squad. Joining Nozix of world's fame on Isaurus will be Daylon. He's going to leave his crew of Chaos behind to join Nozix and see what him and the rest of Isaurus can accomplish in 2017. Down in Oceania, we also see some changes. The entire roster of Alpha Sydney has gone kaput. Everybody is going to walk in their own direction, just effectively disbanding that team and in search of higher spots for the new season. Roster changes are always going to happen come the end of the season, or in this case, the beginning of the season. Players are still not done jockeying around four positions, but we'll keep a close eye on every single change. As we learn more, you'll learn more. Make sure to stay tuned to Smite Pro, esports.smitegame.com, and of course, everywhere else involved in the Smite scene to make sure you're the most up to date on the Smite Pro League.